Annie, what's the last year been like since you became world champion? Uh, I think it was a very positive year for myself. However, a lot of people have asked whether this defines the peak of my career. Mm, quite the opposite. I believe this is only the beginning of the uh, very long journey for me. And even the best player cannot guarantee his win for every game. But I believe there's still a lot for me to learn. Um, both on and off the table, and if I keep on learning, I can only get stronger. Um, Everybody is excited about you taking on the men, but you also have to defend your title in the World Championships against the women. Which one are you more excited about? Um, I think to me, the best way to do my very best is forget about winning or losing and to respect every match and every opponent. And during the game, my focus will be 100% on the task in front of me at the moment. And, and I will do everything possible to apply what I have learned from my daily training and enjoy the game. And at the end of the day, uh, you need to like what you do in order to do well. Yeah, so you've, um you're going to play in the men's qualifiers and you've had the experience recently of playing some of the world's top men in exhibition games. Um, what did you learn from playing the likes of Gint and so on? Um, I think I had the opportunity to play with a few of top players including James Watana, Stuart Bingham and Deng last year. I also played at the APDC event Although it was out very early, but I think these opportunities to play stronger players have greatly improved my game and techniques. So uh, for the coming year, I have already discussed with my coaches um, the wish to spend more time competing on the men's tour and benefiting from more training in UK on top of that. Uh, I just want to do everything I can to be a better player each and every day. And the Wishal will then hopefully take care of themselves.